Y'all, I'm in the Utah getting ready to move in my crack apartment. These niggas outside the hotel fighting. What the fuck? pandemic it's so much stress look at my wig y'all i'm looking crazy my brother ain't answer the phone nigga i know you all some bullshit because you don't want to help me move shit look i don't even need you to help me move nothing i will take that shit up there myself okay i'm still healing from my surgery Ooh, i'm looking snatched baby <laughs> but i can take the shit up the steps myself like dog this is some ghetto shit now i was supposed to meet this lady to buy this car and her baby's sick or whatever but i'm just upset like because i was going to use my the truck i bought and it's like she waiting so late it's like <sighs> it's like i need the car like it's getting dark outside and it's like I wanted to go to the Secretary of State to get the plate and all of that for the car, but it don't look like it's gonna happen. Like, it's just not happening. It's like, this pandemic is making people wild as fuck, man. This, this pandemic making people crazy than a motherfucker. And I don't know if they put something in that shot they gave people, but I started feeling crazy as hell after I had my injection, but it could have been trauma. Like I was under like a lot of stress, stress from my surgery, stress from my spouse. So yeah, I'm in the U-Haul at the crack motel, getting ready to drive to my crack apartment. I don't have no furniture. So, um, y'all want to come with me and look at some furniture? Because I know they're going to be looking at me like, she ain't got no money. She a crack hole. She a hood rat. This and this and that. Let's see. I'm going to take y'all with me. Uh, <laughs> I told y'all my life is so fucking funny. Like, it never fails. <laughs> it's always something. I'm in my hometown, Inkster. Um, I sold my home and Inkster. I wish I hadn't sold it because to me, I could have got more for the house. I feel like the the owner, the the realtor did a type of deal with the uh, air person because, you know, they be doing little deals on the side to make my house lower so he could use it. And then he just ended up... Um, land contract in the house to somebody and then like um i guess the person not paying the um the water bill over there or whatever so i don't know but if it goes into foreclosure i probably would buy it back <laughs> but my neighbor is so fucked up over there like he's so fucked up like i just could not take um the racism over there like the white man he was just too much like i tried to run him over with my car I, should i be saying this on camera because when the police came they couldn't find no evidence of what i did but yeah <laughs> so i knew it was time for me to move or whatever so um i don't know why these jamaican scammers be trying to scam me look nigga i'm married to a, a, a scammer so I know all the little scams and all the little stuff that y'all do. So why would you even send me that shit? And it's like, when they send it to me, let me tell you what I do. I I, I send the FBI, I send them that information to the FBI. That's what I do every time they send it to me. So if you a scammer, I'm the person you should never do it to because I'm going to send you send you to where they can find you. Okay? So don't send me that stuff. Okay? Okay, okay. And if y'all see these scammers 
and you get tired of them on your shit, all you do is report them to the FBI. Report them. Like, why keep leaving them on your post and not doing nothing? Like, report them motherfuckers. Like, report them. They ain't giving you no money to be on your post. They ain't giving you no money. Report their asses. I'm not getting no money. Re report. So, yeah. Um, this is going to be interesting. I'm going to have to cut this uh part of my video short, but... I think these vlogs are really, really funny. Um, yeah. So I'm gonna um not sure what this lady is saying about this car, if I'm gonna meet her with the car, but it's getting late and I need to get some furniture and I haven't ate nothing or drank nothing the whole morning. I got my food from my refrigerator inside the back of the truck. So I'm just trying to go ahead and get to my little crack apartment <laughs> and um that's it and go look at some furniture because it's very small so i'm gonna try i want a bed but i may have to just get a full time because it's so small in there but i really want a bed um because i like to sleep i'm older so yeah i want to get my my place situated and stuff like that so i'm gonna show you guys um me furniture shopping i'm gonna show you guys me um i don't know if my brother go answer because he look he just getting off the road so he just want to stay home and chill i understand like i understand brother like i'm in the u-haul i just want to go get my my luggage and put it in the back of the thing and get myself in my apartment because it has all my makeup and all my personal things in there and i want to look and see what i got before i start shopping for my place because i don't want to spend a lot of money um i'm going to show you guys how you can really do an apartment nice with a very little money you can get stuff off walmart liquidations you can buy off facebook marketplace you can find very very cheap furniture cheap things to decorate your place you don't have to spend the money uh, i'm gonna show y'all how i pretty much furnish my whole apartment for less than 800 dollars. and this is gonna be really cool and i think you guys are really gonna like how i design it and how pretty it comes out so Let's get started. So my fat ass is hungry. Um, the lady called back about the car, but she irritated me. I don't know, but I want to get moved into my crack apartment. I'm going to try this Indian food. This is the Mara Ja Grill. Did I say that right? I like Indian food. So. Indian is not Native American food. What do you want, uh, let me put my mask on because uh, if they finna be tripping y'all, I'm fully vaccinated, baby. Um, I don't have no problem with taking my vaccine. It's hard out here in these streets. Uh, it's got a nice setting in here. It's COVID time. Everybody's sitting down. I'm gonna get the curry chicken. That's what I'm gonna get y'all. I'm gonna show y'all what it looks like. I love curry chicken. So here's the basmati rice. Um, this curry is kind of orange looking. Right? I don't really like the orange. They put some type of, it's gotta be some type of tomato base in it. I don't really like it like that. I like it the way you make it, make it. I like yellow curry. But this is the Indian made one, so. I might have to just make it when I get to my place the way I like it. Container, like, yeah. it's good
Mm. No, some curry chicken. I just don't like the tomatoy thing that's in it, but it's still good though. Everybody make their curry different, but I just like it with the curry powder. Um, so Indian food I like curry chicken. The butter chicken is good too. Um, I like I actually like the butter chicken. I sure hate that my uh music cut off, y'all. Um, I'm on my way to uh pick up the. I didn't film the guy that I got the desk from, but I paid twenty five dollars for this desk. I got it from Facebook Marketplace. I'm on my way to uh pick up my futon um on the other side of town so that's what i'm doing now the traffic is pretty slow um and that desk is just rattling in the back of there y'all love this lipstick this is a uh, sephora this is their brand um their liquid matte lipstick um i really love this i, I caught it on sale um but yeah that's the lip I'm wearing. I mean, I love this red. It's like a good Christmassy, Christmassy, Christmassy red. Christmas season, always red, always red, always red. Yeah, so I'm back driving. I got my car fixed. Um, I'm so hurt. I had to pay $750 to, to fix it, and it's still not quite fixed yet. I got to fix the window, and then um, I got an exhaust leak, too. So I have to fix that sooner or later. Um, so it's a little noisy when I ride it. But other than that, it rides smooth and my check engine light is off. So I'm feeling good about that. Thank you, Snappy. <laughs> you took all my money, but um, he made sure he fixed my car off. So that's what's, what is what matters. So um, here we go. I'm on my way to go pick up my full time from this young lady. I gotta stop and get some money out the ATM machine. Your girl is broke, um, but it is what it is. So let's go ahead.